Welcome back, welcome back to the show. I feel like people are actually sleeping on this new girl. Okay, I, I don't know how to pronounce her name. King, M King Maddie. Maddie. Yeah, that's how it's pronounced, yeah. but that's not how it's written. But King Maddie. I think people are actually sleeping on her because she she's good. She has so much work already. Mm. Like in the next how many years, she has so much to to give out. And yeah, we should actually be on the lookout for her because she's amazing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's that time of the day when we come through with some amusement come as we through, like bang, bang, bang. be looking at some <laughs> hilarious moments from the social media space. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Social View. Whoa, what did you say? Come through like bang, bang, bang. bang. <laughs> Don't twist it. You come through like bang, 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 bang. Bang, bang what? Bang. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Are you ready for social? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. All right, so first off, this guy says, I can't believe there are still Nigerians that wash clothes with their hands in 2020. Kenny. Kenny. Motara now says, do you get, I don't understand. I beg, take several seats. There is stuff that you can't even wash yes, with the washing wash machine. machine. It, it's a spoil. Mm -hmm. Yes, I was mm -hmm. talking about how to take care of your bra, mm -hmm. you know, the other day. Mm -hmm. And I was telling people that do not ever throw your bra mm -hmm. inside the washing machine because you will not get the best of it. Mm -hmm. You get, mm -hmm. and do not even wash with hot water. Mm -hmm. You will not get the best of it. I was taking people through it. Mm -hmm. So it's not even everything that you wash with the washing machine. Like so which that. one is? You will see, you know, all the people that say, uh, Ojo or Larry are like, uh, <laughs> hey, I can't believe that. People start washing. I beg you. You ask this person, when did you start washing your clothes? Yeah. Washing it? She... But true, a lot of the engineers don't even look at the label. They don't. And so I even Some labels there, they tell you it's hand wash. Now, I actually talked about that separately mm -hmm. so how you can you should always read your label because there are some times that you get some clothes that if you have to just follow what they have told you to follow mm -hmm. or else you're going to damage the fabric and then you say oh this fabric when I buy this clothes mm -hmm. just because you did not look at the label you think that those things are just there for decoration don't let me start uh, sounding like a pro doctor <laughs> right <laughs> right now so stop it all right let's check out the next one and Ron Sinwa makes an appearance here and he says, What is the most unintelligent lie a partner has ever told you in a relationship? And he says, Saved my name as hmm. And said <laughs> it was an abbreviation for he's my man. <laughs> is it in Chinese language? Let me tell you the one that somebody has ever told me. And so every time I meet people and my first introduction, I tell you where I'm from. The person said that because I'm from Ijebu. <laughs> <laughs> and it wasn't as if the person just knew that I am from Ijebu, like we've been dating. And mm -hmm. then when I asked, when the person was ask, acting up, you know, I think somebody <laughs> I dated when I was seven. And then I, I just said, uh, why, why are you acting up? said, eh, you know, you are from Ijebu. I said, are you just knowing? So afterwards, anytime I meet anybody, I'm like, I'm from Egypt. You have any problem with it? <laughs> <laughs> Before you come on there and say, yeah, but let's, from let's agree. Women are the ones that save men's name in the most ridiculous way. I don't think so. I think men do it the most. Yes, you have ice cream for instance. Jepo ice. No, that one is How better. How do you save my name? So, How did you save my name? It's Jepo now. Why just Jepo? Okay, Jepo, my love. I'm going to change it to Mr. Flames, my love. The fire, the fire in my. <laughs> Anyway, let me tell you something. So, for ladies, it's quite different from guys. Mm. And I think it's very insulting the way guys actually do this. So, now, let me explain. So, for I ladies... I will not take that for guys. So, it might just be that ice cream, you're always coming through when it comes to ice cream. Hey. You sound like j Paul ice cream. But, guys, you can just see... Mm, like that. Mm. And then you say... Oh, like an injunction. Go for big bad thing. Oh, and then it's injunction. Like... They say, all, no, no, no like me Pekas. They say, they say, Dorothy Pekas. No, so, because we move around a <laughs> lot, we move around a lot. Get out. We travel, we You go don't have any excuse. So, we have to attach your name to You like, don't have place. any excuse. For you, you're attaching it to products. How about the person that did? Mm. <laughs> I said, it shows me. Oh, God. Get it's okay. sad. We'll talk about this. <laughs> all right, so the next one here is uh, it's so cold. Where is my duvet? The same way they use a grandmama lace sleep <laughs> is the thought that matters, not the expensive. Thing. Yes, you can be using lace, and in your head it is duvet. So far, it gives you warmth. So don't mind them. It don't worry. It is duvet that you are using. Ah, uh -uh, kilo shelly. What's so special? The in bed duvet? is too flat. Where's my pillow? <laughs> Let's move on. <laughs> 
All right, next one. My daughter packed the biscuits where she's supposed to chop for a whole week, put inside her lunch bag, and we don't know. She finished everything. And when my wife go pick her from school, her teacher asks her, is it today? Is uh, today is that your daughter's <laughs> This is sounding like what my sister can do. I love this. This is sounding like what my sister even did she when we were small. Send anybody. So my sister was so funny that she even did one. So my, I'm sure that if she watches this thing and she just like, my sister has always been very mischievous. So my brother and my sister, they were in the same school. But my brother was in the boarding house. My sister was a day student. So my sister would come home. I don't know whatever made my parents make such decision. So my brother was saving money with my sister. And I just discovered that my sister would come home and buy Orishi Rishi and she would give me. So one day, that was how my brother now came back home from the boarding house and now said, um, the money I've been keeping with you, how much is it now? Please go and bring. And my sister looked at me and said, eh, it's the money that we have been using. Uh. I said, what? <laughs> Did I beg you? Did I ask you? You chop on my you know chop on. You chop on. She now did another one. <laughs> this girl, she Why did you not ask questions? When when she was, so I think that that's very, because this, this is what <laughs> some people do these days. So you don't ask questions when they are bringing. You only leave us. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's check out the next one. And it says, Ajay, if you enter a Kurodu bus and nobody drop at a Greek, just know that you have been kidnapped. <laughs> I am so sorry. So that a Greek is somewhere that people must actually alight. Oh, really? I didn't know that bit. I have stayed with my cousin in a Greek before. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, they said that they call it family bus stop. But one thing I don't like about the a Greek was that when I was staying with my cousin, uh, I can be going into the bathroom now. It's not raining, you know, because I dreaded it that it rained because they have red soil. Mm. So... You know, so I say, ah, wait, you just get into the bathroom and then I come out and it's raining already and you're mm. going to work. Mm. I feel like, what? You know, you don't want to face that thing. You just want to. So they have red soil. That's so what I don't like red about. red soil orange in color? Is yes. You know, that's, um, I be sure we should say orange soil now. Is that why OJ is orange juice? Because OJ has a house. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. The color of his body matches is. <laughs> in Greek. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we've come to the end of Socialville. And we hope you were entertained because I was entertained. Were you entertained? I mean, I entertained, I entertained you now. Yeah, you did. For coming back to meet me in peace and not in pieces. I thank the Lord. Lori Jepo Olua Gbokwewa, Ami. Lori Jepo Olua Gbanyewa, Ami. We have come to the end of the segment. True Syndrome Monday is up next. In case you <laughs> missed the question earlier, we asked... What character traits did you inherit from your parents? I know only for some prayer. <laughs> <laughs>